nervous system nerve cells the nervous system is the body's information gatherer storage center and control system its overall functions are to collect information about the body's external or internal states and transfer this information to the brain to analyze this information and to send impulses out to initiate appropriate motor responses to meet the body's needs neuroscience is the study of the nervous system nervous systems are found in most multicellular animals but vary greatly in complexity human body contains 100 billion nerve cells the system is composed of specialized cells termed nerve cells or neurons that communicate with each other and with other cells in the body a neuron has three parts the cell body containing the nucleus dendrites hair like structures surrounding the cell body which conduct incoming signals the axon or nerve fiber varying in length from a millimeter to a meter which conduct outgoing signals emitted by the neuron axons are encased in a fat like sheath called myelin which acts like an insulator and along with nodes of rand wire speeds impulse transmission typically a given neuron is connected to many thousands of neurons the specific point of contact between the axon of one cell and a dendrite of another is called a synapse messages passed to and from the brain take the form of electrical impulses or action potentials produced by a chemical change that progresses along the axon at the synapse the impulse causes the release of neurotransmitters like acetylcholine or dopamine and this in turn drives the impulse to the next neuron these impulses travel very fast along this chain of neurons up to the 250 miles per hour this contrasts with other systems such as the endocrine system which may take many hours to respond with hormones the nerve cell bodies are generally located in groups within the brain and spinal cord the collections of neurons are called nuclei and constitute the gray matter so called because of their color outside the brain and spinal cord the groups are called ganglia the remaining areas of the nervous system are tracts of axons the white matter so called because of white myelin sheath tracts carrying information of a specific type such as pain or vision generally have specific names somatosensory receptors input to the nervous system is in the form of our five senses touch pain vision taste smell and hearing pain temperature and pressure are known as somatic senses sensory receptors are classified according to the type of energy they can detect and respond to mechano receptors hearing and balance stretching photo receptors light chemo receptors smell and taste mainly as well as internal sensors in the digestive and circulatory systems thermo receptors changes in temperature electro receptors detect electrical currents in the surrounding environment glial cells 
Glial cells are non-neuronal cells that provide support and nutrition, maintain homeostasis, form myelin and participate in signal transmission in the nervous system. In the human brain, it is estimated that the total number of glia roughly equals the number of neurons, although the proportions vary in different brain areas. Among the most important functions of glial cells are to support neurons and hold them in place, to supply nutrients to neurons, to insulate neurons electrically, to destroy pathogens and remove dead neurons, and to provide guidance, cues directing the actions of neurons to their targets. A very important type of glial cell generates layers of fatty substance called myelin that wraps around axons and provides electrical insulation which allows them to transmit action potentials much more rapidly and efficiently.